Hi family, this is the luck mom here, the branch is my name. I'm an ex housemaid of Saudi Arabia and mostly I create awareness on what happens in the Middle East. Sometimes I do help those domestic workers who are stuck in the Middle East. If you are facing any challenge, you can just reach me out. My number is on my bio. You go to my profile, you see the word phone, you press it, it will bring you to my WhatsApp direct. So I'm just updating this. You can see me smiling. It means we have good news. Uh, this is the case I've done for two months. This is the, it was long and complicated. You remember our sister Eshirama Angara. Kutoka Kakamega County. So, uyu msiana alikuwa meenda Saudi Arabia. Akafanya kazi, akamaliza miaka miwili. Akafanya kazi without pay for one year. And then, ule agent wake mwenye alikuwa memupeleka Saudi Arabia, alikuwa mewapea wrong number. Number nyima nikuwa kwa t-shirt ya hiko WhatsApp, hiko malipopote ya ifanyi. So, I'm just sharing this because I've learned something na watu wengine wanafaa kujua. So, hakuwa na mpata kwa WhatsApp wala malipopote. But when the sister reached me out, akaliambia sister yao wakona shida na alipeleko na ofisi naituwa Kerry Gold. We, wacha nitafuta hivyo mwanamuki ya naituwa Mary. Mary aliniambia ni uze mchele wangu kwa amani. Ni wachane na wambo ya wasiana wa golf. But I just want to tell her like the lady now has already arrived home. Ako nyumbani kabisa ame ini picha ambayo alinitume wakati alifika airport. So nilikuwa nataka kuambia watu wa the luck mom family. Mubarikiwe sana hadi mshangai. By the way to give up. Na hii ndio, this is the only way tutasaidiana wakati watu wetu wako kwa shida. Tusisikize mambo ya agents sana. Do, kuna watu watauliza alilipwa sasa. Alilipwa tu hafa ya. So, wako mlipa the rest. Six, alimulipa tu six months after your pressure. Na wakati nilikuwa nafuatilia vizuri huu msichana wakati alikuwa na shida. Ali, hakuweza kupata msaada. Hakuweza kupata msaada. Alijaribu kukimbia lakini haku alishikwa na boss waka kapiwa akarudishwa ni msiana mdogo sana. So amekuwa akifanya kwa ile nyumba na akipitia mateso. Hata vile nilikuwa nimemweka online akakuja akaenda aka missing kabisa. Tuka tena tukaanza kufuatilia watu wa Delaku mom family tunafuatilia lakini inakata jiru wake alikuwa mbaya sana. So mimi nilifurahia sana kwa sababu sasa wakati yali, wali, ni kumbe walimu disconnect wifi wakachukua line yao ya Saudi Arabia so kumpata ilikuwa ngumu. So the first time tuliongea na ye ni wakati alifika airport ya Sharjah. Jua kifika airport jua walichukua line ya, yao so inafanya WhatsApp inafanya. Ndiyo nileza kujua kuwa wame release na wakua, wako, wakua specific siku yenye wata release lakini nataka kuambia watu wa the luck mom family. You shared this video, you acted. Mubarikiwe sana. Mubarikiwe sana, musia ikosa. Na nataka kukaribisha umu wanarada nyumbani. Shirama, tunakupenda, you are still our sister. Tunataka you join the luck mom family. Najua ukuwa na matumaini. Alikuwa nasema sasa luck mom wanasema inashugulikiwa, nashugulikiwa, nasioni matumaini. But I thank God that I meweza kufika nyumbani. At least that I mean takuwa na amani kidogo. Then I want to thank her sister, Eva. Eva didn't give up. Eva mekua kifuatilia. Akifuatilia. Akisema. Like mom sa kunaenda aje. Sister angu kunaenda aje. Najua mekua a very tough moment for the family. Mama yake halikuwa nasema. Like mom tukona matumaini. Atujaona kunaenda aje. But ni kuna furaha saa hizi. Na vile wawa kuna furaha. Pia mini kuna furaha. Najua. Mungu wa metenda. Na nataka kuambia watu, tusiwe tunagive up. Usigive up. Tukifanya kitu hapa. Unaweza kuyona kama ni joke. But so long as uh, we can put a smile on somebody's face. Afadhali tutufanya. Without giving up. So, nataka kuambia tu. Ukiwa ukona shida. Usiwe unafanya kazi bila malipo. By the way, alifanya kazi for one year without pay. Na maybe unaweza kano pia tunge mpata. Kwa sababu hata kupata namba za ofisi. Haikuwa raisi. So, working one year without pay, unonyesha tajiri uko comfortable. Usiogope. Kama we ni mtu mwenye umefanya kazi for one year without pay, some months without pay, anza kutafuta msaada mapema. 
Usifanye huyo tajiri aone kama hiyo pesa anakupatia bure na ni kazi unafanya. Na huyo msana alikuwa mdogo sana, I think ndio maana walikuwa wanamhangaisha sana. Nataka ku advise wale wasichana wadogo. Tafadhali kama hujapitia mashida mingi, hata uspi, hata ukipitia mashida mingi kuna edge. Sorry, kuna edge ya nyao watu wanaona wewe ni mtoto. Wanaanza kukutumia vibaya, usikubali kutumika vibaya. Kama hujalipwa tafuta mbinu yenye unaweza fanya ili uweze kuupewa pesa yako. Na tunaelewana. Mimi naweza furahia sana nikiona watu wakijipigania mapema usingoje madeni pile up ndio uweze kuitisha msaada. I think she didn't know anything about me. Yale, ni, ni sister yake alikuwa ananijua she is the one who reached me out on behalf of her sister ndio pia mimi nikaweza kujua what was going on so nataka kushukuru watu wa the luck mom family i love you so much i don't give uh, any year to to hate us those people keep on trolling me i just want to remind you i'm the luck mom i am unshakable so long as umekuja kwa space yangu ukanipata pale mimi nimechukua mwavuli nikakaa kwa kivuli na ngojo ufike tuongeleshane but nimefurahi sana the way the luck bomb family wamekuwa karibu na mimi tunaenda kumaliza mwaka wa tatu sasa tunaenda wa nne na imekuwa ni maisha yetu ya kawaida hiyo inanifurahisha sana because the family is increasing each day na mtu akiamua kutafuta kutafutia mtu msana anasema luck like, mom wananitumia screenshot mpaka nasema wa kuna watu wako na roho anasema luck like, mom see what i have said I've talked to this uh, maybe agent ona vile utajiri anasema ona vile huyu anasema mpaka inakuwa ina make sense so mubarikiwe sana tuko pamoja i'll keep on updating uh, so that what wajue that our aim is to make this world a better place for everyone thank you